If you don't sustain your legacy, you'll destroy it. If you sustain it, you'll amplify it without much effort at all. Your name could end up on the side of a building, or you can realize your dream of supporting a world-class foundation that is synonymous with the cause you're passionate about. Stabilizing your legacy now prevents heartache and regret later. Write your succession plan. To make your plan succeed, you've got to write them down. Start with your impact statement. Talk it out with the family and write it down. Answer these three critical questions. Number one, what are the needs for you and your future generations? Number two, what's at stake? Number three, what needs to be accomplished? Number four, who do you need to work with to get there quickly? The second generation of wealth creators have the most difficult time. They have a tremendous amount of pressure in the family. The father usually wants his son to take over the old man's business, keep it going. He wants to see that the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. But not all families are like that today. Many families are not nuclear, and many are broken. Some fathers have second wives, and with that come second families. Some have extended families. But it's important to discuss with your family so they know what you want and how you want the business and family legacy to be handled. How do you see the future going for the next three generations? Who do you want to be associated with? No matter how you see the future, you need to define it. Write it down. Make sure it's something substantive and very clear because it will give you an understanding of what you're looking for. When you wake up in the morning and ask, what am I doing this for? And you'll have an answer.